copy. 240 negative? Sorry. False alarm on that code red near Magnolia. Try that carpet shop off Post Alley. Thanks, 303. Copy. Dispatch, I need to run a license check on that 10 Officer Matthews, I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. See you tonight! Don't be late, losers! Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Okay, just don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. Would be awesome to see you there? What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, uh, because they're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Well... The suspense is killing me. It's dad. Wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a ten-year-old. He just cares about you, Sean. Anyway, you should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen. Saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So... So what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Hey, lovebirds. Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. We need to find a couch for your yard one day.
Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? Hmm. Nah. Maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know? Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa, what the hell are don't you doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it. Munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All right. Blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C-O-N-D-O... Ugh, stop. You're out of room, punk. Is this how you see a penis? Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You don't want to go down that road, dude. My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> you wish. Uh, these fucking planes, man. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them so much if I move somewhere else. Shit changes so fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? <sighs> no es posible, sister. With all that shit going on, dirty Mexican like me hanging out with an Asian chick? Huh. I mean, that's a one-way ticket to jail. Oh, I'm not worried. You'll be pacing your ass off behind that wall way before me. <sighs> Shit, you're right. I need to get cooler than you. So my 10,000 followers keep me out of trouble. I mean, no way you can, but I love you anyway. Okay, it's getting way late and I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night. <laughs> hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure, but I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said- Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey, no shh, fair. Shh, shh, shh. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I, I have to go. Uh... Get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week. Or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage. Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. Oh, 
Hmm. Daniel was guilty of being a brat, so the Choco Crisp goes to Senor Diaz. What? No way. You're a cheat. <laughs> nope. I'm the law. Your Honor, I can't let you punish an innocent man. So? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I always knew you'd confess. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. I have to go to work in my room, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Don't hurry back. Okay, let's get this party list started. Dad flips out if I don't pick up my stuff, but Daniel leaves his shit all over. Do not enter, ever. <sighs> Trust me, Dad, I won't. Every Christmas, Dad wants to watch the Lord of the Rings trilogy with us. That's cool. Man, is there any more boring sport than baseball? <laughs> but you do you, Dad. Can't wait for the rain. Makes me feel like drawing. Daniel spends hundreds of hours yelling into the mic playing Minecraft with Noah. Jeez, how old is this? We've had it since I was 10. I don't know who plays more, Daniel or Dad. I could just stay home and binge Top Gear with Dad and Daniel, but <laughs> not tonight. That's right. Que pendejo. Real funny, Dad. Uh, promise. I hope there's also, like, real food at this party. Cross that off the list. Food down, drinks to go. This will work. I don't want to get wasted in front of Jen. <laughs> Man, Daniel could live off this crap. Ted doesn't drink that much. Does he keep track? Damn, Lila's so hyped up for tonight. Better hurry. Asshole.
Eric got us some purple last month. <sighs> it was fucking insane. Lila provides the weed tonight. I better be ready. My first hangover. <sighs> Dad laughed at me so hard when I came back home. Very funny, Lila. Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Very funny, Lila. Good thing my boss has a sense of humor. Kind of. Damn. I still have like 10 books left in the series. I won't finish until I'm 20. Oh, hi, Gunther. Sorry. You stay hidden here. We... got these for free during sex ed last year. <sighs> Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. Sorry, Lila. I'm just not a selfies kind of guy. Okay. Don't be a stalker, Sean. Man, this is taking forever. Do they want me to pay for it? Oh my god. The internet was a mistake. I think I know what to ask for Christmas. I should practice instead of putting it up here. But it looks pretty rad. I really like that one. <laughs> I don't totally suck. Thanks, Daniel. I'll, uh, treasure this gift always. Lila will survive if I take five to practice my drawing. I should take a good look at the subject before drawing. Time to take the pen, dude. The lighting is nice. It's been a while since I've sketched my room. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. <sighs> okay. Got it. My room almost looks cool on this. Not an easy task. <laughs> Good job. Time to get in the mood for tonight. Come on, open up. Why? <laughs> because. Okay, okay. 
What are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? You gave my choco Chris to Dad. So what? He gave it back. Dude, you're so spoiled. What's with the sisters? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Oh, man. Damn, sounds pretty serious. Should I call an ambulance now before it's too late? Maybe. <laughs> All I can say is watch out for my costume in three days. This Halloween is going to be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will Lila be there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. Did she ask about me? <sighs> I'm sorry, dude. She's cheating on you. Shut up! Aunt... I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Of course you do. Daniel's always up to something. Wonder what's next. Hey, Jen. What's up? Oh, try again, loser. Hey, you look totally hot. Oh my god, stop. Oh. Hey, you wanna share my blanket? Hey, Jen. Do you wanna hang out sometime? Not bad. Remember, don't be too thirsty. Daniel better not use my toothbrush again. I'm broke. Damn. The guy never stops working. Will Dad actually take us there one day? <laughs> Doubt it. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? Can't believe Dad actually asked me to tag up this wall. Well, of course. He asked Daniel, too. Dad should just sell that other bike. How long is he going to keep all this shit? Thank God I don't have to take one of Daniel's. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. Dad said we could go to Mount Baker this year. The trails are insane. That you, Sean? It's me, Daniel. Cool. Can you tell your big brother he's grounded tonight when you see him? Hey, since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Sure, can do. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, shoot, must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez. That was definitely my plan for tonight. So, yeah. Hold on.
Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi, friend. How's this like? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Uh, remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it, so I can change its direction. Did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Calloway is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. <sighs> prejudiced against Vonnegut. Is that it? Yes, this is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, yeah. All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade, art, Athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while, too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job, living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, oh, I've heard this one before. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Well, you don't have to. I mean, it's cool. Are you sure you're my son? You don't want to visit Mexico. You don't want to have a car. I can't even get you into Rush or Santana. Are you going to ride the bus for all your dates? Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't even know what cock blocking is. He looks up to you, Jean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um, by the way, ha. Huh. I was wondering how long it'd take. You need money for the party tonight, right? <sighs> ah, 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 ah. Shh. Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? Um, I mean... Yeah, probably. But we'll be partying at a house and nobody's driving home. I swear. Well, everybody's got to get home somehow. But yeah, you and Lila better not get in any car with somebody who can't walk straight. Holy shit, 40 bucks? Really? Yeah, why not? You did a good job on the lawn. Plus, I appreciate that you didn't lie to me. Thanks, Dad. Just be careful. That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. When you were my age, did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Now get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home, would you? <laughs> all right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Ugh.
Okay, have fun. But not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood. Even though he won't tell. I would be fucked if I had to help Dad in the shop. Running the garage was Dad's dream. I'm proud of him. Honestly. Ah, yeah. I tried to read that. Snooze. Dad loves all that political crap. Finally, ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. Oh, lower boy. Just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. <laughs> okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so... We're set for the night. In case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else... Ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? Well, I don't know. Played cool talk about the gig last week, get to know her tastes. Oh, oh my god, you did rehearse your moves for tonight. You're totally into her. So what? I don't have any game. These are uncharted territories for me. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean, I'm done, look. I made zombie blood. It's, um, Corn syrup and food coloring. Hey. Hi, <sighs> Lila. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just... Come on, man. Just the... Just bugging the uh, shit out of what? me again after I told you to knock? Uh, yeah, what? I know. <sighs> anyway. Sean, you're an asshole. What's your problem? <gasps> but... I want to see zombie blood if you don't. He's not always cute. You would sound like me, too, if you lived with him. Anyway. You wouldn't be so uptight if you got laid. And maybe tonight's the night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Let me see that drawing. Um, nah, sorry. It's too good for your eyes. <laughs> Whatever. Wait until I draw you tonight and show it to Jen. Ooh, shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it out. It might get your attention. Whoa, her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh, you will see. It will wash off. You'll see. <laughs> I see you, Sean. Should we set the wedding date now? Hey, come on. It's just a heart. I like her hair, okay? 
No big deal. Sure. Leave me alone. I'll call my dad. Hold on, okay? Something's going on outside. What do you mean? Hey. Look at my shirt, asshole. What's the big deal? It's Halloween. Uh, hey! Don't ever touch my brother. You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt. Look! I told you, it was an accident. You better leave us alone. Oh, yeah. Go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Dude, step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again. Or what? You're gonna get your daddy? Hey, asshole. I don't need him to protect me from you. Oh, you, you wanna go? Oh, yeah, <laughs> motherfucker? Then go back to your own country. <laughs> Whoa! Sean, you hit him! <sighs> get inside now! Sean! You're dead meat, bitch! <sighs> You and your whole fucking family are going to jail, losers! Uh, what's going Fuck on? Me. Daniel, get over here! Sean, is he hurt? Okay, okay, step away. Now! Calm down, officer! Shut up! And step back! On the ground! Now! Hey, wait! This guy was he started beating it. up my little brother. Ground. Now, hands behind your head. This is fucking bullshit. Oh no. Sean, what's Get happening? On the ground, sir. Dad, we didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. I'm, Shut this up. I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. I want to go home. They're good kids, officer. Don't move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. I said don't move. We didn't Daniel, do anything. It's going to be all right. On the ground.
No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being being in a home or or in your room. This is a a real adventure, right? So come on. Let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you, okay? Okay, but I am so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know, I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome pause. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, <laughs> Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! We can be wolves. Yeah, yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once, huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no, run! What? You're it! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! Blah!
we there yet? Dude, stop. You know what? You're not allowed to say that. Ever again. Yes, sir. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry, too. Listen, this looks like a perfect place to camp out. I bet we're not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. <laughs> 